Hi everyone, it's Coach Mark here from Freeform Fitness back with you to provide my five favorite tips to get you started on your journey. Are you ready for this? Here we go. Number one, and I want you to look me right in the eye for number one. You are not ugly. You are already the most beautiful thing in the world. You are not starting your journey into fitness, be it at the gym, be it hiking, be it sports, be it better nutrition, because you are ugly. You're starting this journey because you are so capable of doing anything you want. You're already beautiful. So I want you to hear me when I say, you are not ugly. Your mirror is lying to you. Start your journey to enhance the you that you already are, because you're already awesome. All right, you got this. Number two, there is nothing wrong with you. Identifying an ailment, identifying something that you want to improve, identifying something that you want to change, identifying an amount of weight that you want to gain or lose, none of that means you are identifying that there's something wrong with you. Human beings have experienced ailments and illnesses and injuries and weight gain and weight loss since the dawn of time. We all experience the highs and lows, the normal parts of being human. And so it's okay to identify the thing or the things that you would like to change or improve upon or grow from without feeling like you're identifying that there's anything wrong with you because there is nothing wrong with you. Okay, you got this. Number three, if you are going to become interested in calories because you understand that to gain mass, you need to be in a caloric surplus, which means you need to consume more calories than you use. Or if you want to lose mass, you have to be in a caloric deficit, which means you use more calories than you consume. I want to invite you to become calorie conscious rather than a calorie counter. Counting calories to the infinite decimal place is just going to discourage you from staying on your journey. So what I want you to think about is becoming calorie conscious, if that's a part of your journey. If you want to gain muscle, you're going to need to eat a little bit more food. You're going to need to eat more calories than you use. That's just science. But I invite you to do so by filling yourself up with food you like and that's good for you because there's joy in what you're doing. Rather than just counting calories for the sake of counting calories, become calorie conscious. We don't need to obsess over them, but they are real. They are a part of the journey. So invite them in gently, invite them in with joy and the journey will just be that much easier. Okay, you got this. Number four, oops, <laughs> number four. 15 minutes of exercise is more than no minutes of exercise. One healthy meal a day is more than no healthy meals a day. So just start your journey. It doesn't have to be perfect. In fact, you know what? Let's get this idea out of our head. It will never be perfect. It can't be perfect. As I said in tip number two, human beings are not perfect. We have the ups and downs of life. But doing something is where we start. Put one foot in front of the other if you are so able to do and begin your journey. Every little step matters. So rather than doing an all or nothing, just start, okay? You got this. Number five, and this is, my friends, this is so important to me. Your ability to deadlift 500 pounds or touch your toes or whatever your sort of vision of fitness and health is, none of that has anything to do with your ability to be a good person. 
when you finally lift those 500 pounds, <laughs> when you finally touch your toes, your house will not get bigger. Your car will not get nicer. Your job will not get easier. Nothing will change unless you take the journey that made you feel that much more beautiful in who you are because you got to that heavy lifting, you got to touching your toes because you paid attention to yourself along the way. You didn't lose sight of who you were along the way. So I want you to remember that at the end of the day, the only thing people will remember you for is how you treated them and how you treated yourself. So as much as I love helping clients and I would love to help you lift as much weight as you want or touch your toes as quickly as you want to be able to, just remember that that will never ever change the beautiful you that you are or perhaps even the more beautiful enhanced you that you'd like to become. Okay, you've got this. I hope those five tips are helpful for you and that they might either kickstart your journey or help you continue on your journey. Again, my name is Mark here at Freeform Fitness, and I can't wait to see you in the gym. Much love. Thanks.